our backyard in its natural state. This is the wall that separates us from the neighbors. This one over here with the artificial siding on it, that's the one that Doodle once ate the insulation out of. Funny story. And this over here is the junkyard, which is entirely the arch nemesis fault. Um, yeah, that might get better. You can see how the blackberries are getting out of control over here on the shed. And then you look around to the hedge, and this is all a hedge. It just goes on for miles. Let's see if I can zoom in on the playhouse, which is right there, poking out of the hedge. When we first moved in here, it was like kind of standing in the middle of the yard, and now it's really hard to see. There's a little bit of the fence. Part of that is gate. You can see across the street, Damascus Garage. That's the uh, lunatic that we all hate. Yeah, I'll zoom in a little bit more. Hi, dumbass. We don't know his real name. And then uh, it just goes directly into the trees that are completely concealing the uh, side of the house. Move a little bit. Sorry, the ground's all bumpy here. Whoa, that was pretty bad. Yeah, there's like some trees and some shrubs and... But again, they just, they just go on forever. It's a little bit appalling. Nice shade on the windows back there, though. So we're not going to have those taken out entirely. Just, you know, cut back. This here is the patio workshop that I'm always talking about. Built out of greenhouse material. Sort of convenient for, you know, when you need to grow something. The white out on that. There we go. That's what that's supposed to look like. So this overall is uh, the before picture of our yard. Check out that hedge. You should see the other side of it. There's a fence in the middle and the hedge is really like the property line except the fence is the real property line. And our neighbors on the other side have cut theirs down to sticks. It's like not even a hedge anymore. So it's kind of bizarre when you go by on the street and hedge and not hedge. I'm kind of hoping that ours will sort of look like that when we're done, but I don't really know. I'm just going to let the guys do whatever it is they do. Ooh. So we'll be back in a couple of days with the after pictures.